So the last of the recognised batsmen in for Pakistan, the former captain of course, Wazim Akram, comes in with his side in desperate trouble at 137 for six. And some lovely shot from Akram, all timing, and down to the extra cover boundary for four runs. That's just why Wazim Akram is up there amongst the leading all-rounders in the world. Good stride in with a leading foot, not all the way, but that doesn't matter. The timing was perfect. Hit the ball late, allowed it to arrive, and then a full flow of the arms. Exquisite stroke. Hitting straight, and this time finding the gap. That's six. That's a lovely stroke. Pakistan 184 for eight. Slow delivery and finding the gap, and that will run away to the boundary. That's a wonderful stroke. Again, adjusting just in time, we see Makram. Kurtley Ambrose thought that it could have been saved when he realized it wasn't going to be saved. That's the spear. Sweeping, and this will run away to the boundary as well. Fellow Wallace missing it. Bad misfield. No. Well, that shouldn't have been missed. No, we don't want to hear what he just said. Totally Ambrose again uh, trying to bowl a slow delivery. Favoring the slow one to a Yorker. And we see Makram reading him well. Last ball of the innings. That's been uh, hit to mid on and Mushtaq will come back for the second. That's very good batting by both these two batsmen. And Pakistan still short but finishing off 197. Played really well. Three fours in a... He might be a little bit disappointed that they got that many but it's not a slow delivery because he obviously... Straight away. Was arrested the other day. Back in today. Big appeal this time. How far forward he got? Far enough. Says the umpire. A little bit forward there. What is happening also is that the ball is hitting him pretty much on the roll and within that. Well, he's got the under edge. It'll go for four. Doesn't matter how they come or where they come at this stage. 